Good morning. It's Patrick Ryan with Sotheby's International Realty here at the Commercial Wharf on the Monterey Bay. This is the wharf that is next to Fisherman's Wharf, where if you go to the end, you will see these two buildings, which is where you can buy fish from the fishermen. So it's a wonderful place to come if you're looking for some fresh fish to barbecue or cook for dinner. Anyways, right now we're gonna do a update for the city of Monterey, comparing the year 2021 to 2022. I'm gonna turn this way so this car doesn't hit me. Um, so in the year 2021, a total of 265 homes sold, and in 2022, 164. That's a 38% decrease. That's significant. That's a lot, 101 less homes sold in 2022 compared to 2021 in Monterey. Average list price was 1.43 million. Average uh, in 2021, average list price in 2022 was 1.53 million. 1.53, where's my cheat sheet? Sorry, 1.54 million. Um, Average sales price in 2021 was 1.44 million, and average sales price in 2022 was 1.53 million. So that's about an eight to seven, seven to eight percent increase year over year. Average days on market in 2021, 31 days. Average days on market in 2022 was 29 days. No, reverse that. Sorry, 2021 was 29 days, and 2022 was 31 days. Average price per square foot. I'm gonna look at my cheat sheet in 2021 was 676 and in 2022 was 757. So um, Monterey was actually a lot like um, Carmel. First half of the year was very busy with uh, a lot of sales, multiple offers in the second half of the year, everything slowed down. So what are we looking for in 2023? Well, right now it's a weird market. It's in transition. Um, buyers are out there. I was holding an open house at our listing on Stewart Place and a lot of buyers are coming in, but they're be being very discerning in their de decision making. I think it's partly the interest rates and partly inflation. And it's just really low inventory. There's not a lot to choose from. So they're being particular in what they're choosing. Um, so for sellers, what thing, what you need to do is, oh, there's a group of seals over here. Let me see if I can turn where we can see them. Anyways, for sellers, what you need to do is make your home very presentable. Can you see the seals right there? They're right behind me, a group of them are swimming. I love it down here. Walked yesterday and saw a bunch of sea otters too. Anyways, for sellers, what you need to do is make your property very presentable to the public. Um, should you paint it inside out? Should you get a home inspection, pest inspection? Should you update, should you remodel? Those are questions to ask. And those are questions to have a good real estate agent that can answer those questions. Uh, for buyers, you know, you have room to negotiate. And those are skills that a good agent has as well. Anyways, I'm gonna sign off here. It's cold this morning. If you have any questions, give me a call. I'll be happy to help you with any listing questions or selling questions. Uh, you'll see my phone number and email pop up on the screen. Thanks, bye-bye.